वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स टू क्लास फोर चैप्टर वन प्लेस वैल्यू एंड नंबर नेम्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू कवर द फॉलोइंग टॉपिक्स अंडर दिस चैप्टर फाइव डिजिट नंबर्स सिक्स डिजिट नंबर्स प्लेस वैल्यू चार्ट्स प्लेस वैल्यूज नंबर नेम्स रिप्रेजेंटिंग नंबर ऑन अबैकस expanded form and in the last i will provide you a worksheet to practice upon let's learn five digit numbers as we already know the largest one digit number is 9 the largest two digit number is 99 the largest three digit number is 999 the largest four digit number is 9999 so what is 9999 plus 1 it is 10000 or we call it 10000 this is the smallest five digit number now what is the largest five digit number 99999 We will learn about how to name five digit number in a short while. Now let's understand place value chart of five digit number. What is place value? Every digit in a number has a value according to its place. This is called as place value. So let's see what all places we have in a five digit number. Starting from left, we have ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, and then ten thousands. Where ones is denoted by O, tens is denoted by T, hundreds is denoted by H, thousands is denoted by TH, and ten thousands is denoted by TTH. Now students let's form a place value chart for a five digit number with the help of an example Example is to write 28456 in a place value chart and read its number name Here starting from left since 6 is at ones place let's put 6 in the ones place in the place value chart Now 5 is at tens place 4 is at hundreds place 8 is at thousands place and 2 is at 10 thousands place so this is how we make a place value chart for the five digit number now i will tell you how to read this number or its number name students always first read thousands places together then read hundreds tens ones places together so the number name for 28456 is 28456 students let's learn how to mark periods in five digit numbers it is very simple to mark periods on the number and it is used to easily read the big numbers here we have an example to mark periods in number 28456 so first period is ones period which is the group of ones tens and hundreds places second period is thousands period which is the group of thousands and 10000 places to mark the periods we use a comma in between ones and thousands period so in this example 28456 we will use a comma between thousands period and ones period thus this number can be rewritten as 28, 456. Students, now 
let's learn how to write place values in five digit numbers example is to write the place values of each digit in 79536 and write its expanded form let's quickly make a place value chart as we did before now let's put 6 at ones place 3 at tens place 5 at hundreds 9 at thousands and 7 at ten thousands place let me make this table a little bit smaller now here since 6 is at ones place its place value is 6 ones or 6 then 3 is at tens place so its place value is 3 tens or 30 5 is at hundreds place so its place value is 5 hundreds or 500 9 is at thousands place so its place value is 9 thousands or 9 thousand and lastly digit 7 is at 10 thousands place so its place value is 7 10 thousands or 70 thousands now we can easily write the expanded form of this number which is 70 thousand plus 9 thousand Plus five hundred, plus thirty, plus six. So, student, this is how we will write the place values of five-digit numbers and their expanded form. Now, let's see how to represent five-digit number on abacus. Example is to represent the number three one zero six eight on abacus. Since we have 8 at one's place we will put 8 beads at one spike next we have 6 at tens place so put 6 beads at ten spike then 0 at hundreds place so we will not put any beads at hundred spike next we have 1 at thousands place so let's put 1 bead at thousands spike and lastly we have 3 at 10 thousands place so we will put 3 beads at 10 thousands spike so students this is how we represent five digit number on abacus students we have now learned five digit numbers let's proceed to learn six digit numbers we already know that the largest five digit number is 99999 so the question is what is 99999 plus 1 it is 100000 or we call it 1 lakh this is the smallest six digit number now what is the largest six digit number it is 999999 or we can read it 9 lakh 99999 now students let's understand place value chart of six digit number we just learned place value chart for five digit numbers ones tens Hundreds, thousand, and ten thousand. We have sixth place in six-digit number. It is known as lakhs and is denoted by L. Students, let's form a place value chart with the help of an example. Example is to write nine two. 8 4 5 6 in a place value chart and read its number name here starting from left since 6 is at ones place let's put 6 at ones place in place value chart now 5 at tens place 4 at hundreds place 8 at thousands place 2 at ten thousands place and lastly 9 at lakhs place 
This is how we make a place value chart for six digit number. Now I will tell you how to read this number or how to write its number name. First read lakhs, then read thousands places together, and lastly read ones, tens, hundred places together. So the number name for nine two eight four five six is nine lakhs twenty eight thousand four hundred. Fifty-six students. Let's learn how to mark periods in six-digit numbers. It is very simple to mark periods on the number and is used to easily read the big numbers. First period is ones period, which is the group of ones, tens, and hundreds places together. Second period is thousands period which is the group of thousands and 10000s places together and third period is the lakhs period which consists of lakhs place so to mark the periods we use comma in between ones period thousands period and lakhs period so in this example 928751 we first Put a comma in between ones and thousands period, and then another comma between thousands and lakhs period. So this number can be rewritten as nine comma two eight comma seven five one. Students, now let's learn the place values of six digit numbers with the help of an example. Write the place values of each digit in. Eight seven nine five three six and write its expanded form. First, let's quickly make a place value chart as we did before. We put six at ones place, three at tens place, five at hundreds, nine at thousands, seven at ten thousands, and lastly eight at lakhs place. Let me make this table a little bit smaller. Now, since Six is at ones place. Its place value is six ones or six. Now three is at tens place, so its place value is three tens or thirty. Similarly, five is at hundreds place, so its place value is five hundreds or five hundred. Now nine is at thousands place, so its place value is nine thousands or Nine thousand. Next, we have seven at ten thousands place, so its place value is seven ten thousands or seventy thousand. And lastly, we have eight at lakhs place, so its place value is eight lakhs or eight lakh. Students, now we have these place values. So let's see how to write the expanded form of a six-digit number. Expanded form of eight seven nine five three six equals to eight lakh plus seventy thousand plus nine thousand plus five hundred plus thirty plus six. Now it is time to learn how to represent six digit number on a backus. Example is to represent the number. Five three one zero six eight on a backus. Since we have eight at ones place, we will put eight beads at ones spike. Next, we have six at tens place, so put six beads at tens spike. Next, zero at hundreds place, so we will not put any beads at hundreds spike. Then we have one at thousands place. So let's put one bead at thousand spike. Then we have three at ten thousand place. So put three beads at ten thousand spike. And lastly, there is five at lakhs place. So let's put five beads at lakhs spike. 
सो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज द वे टू द प्रेजेंट सिक्स डिजिट नंबर ऑन अ बैकस students now in the end i have a worksheet for you for your practice question number 1 is make the place value chart for 736201 write its expanded form and number name also represent the number on abacus next question is make the place value chart for 16234 and write its expanded form and number name also represent the number on abacus question 3 is write the following numbers in words next question is you have to find the sum of place values of red colored digits in the following numbers question 5 is find the difference of place values of red colored digits in 67989 students thanks for watching my video if you like this video make sure to subscribe for more and please do press the bell icon to receive the notification for my next video thank you bye bye see you